Hello everyone, and welcome back to Frankenstein Master of Death, where our friend's wife has just been stolen by a monster and taken through this giant hole in the wall, to which I have found a third lily ornament in the wall. So, there was some place we were supposed to use these. I just don't remember where. Oh my goodness. I don't remember. Oh no, this is where the fire was. Can I get my map? Map. Alright, we got my map. Um, lake shore, path to the lake, fireplace room, merry-go-round? Or was it way over here? Because this place apparently is not done. Oh yeah, the bolts. So no, it was not here. I don't think it was the merry-go-round. Yeah, no, we need a gear here. I don't think there's anything else, so... Not what I wanted. Was it in here? No, I don't... Oh, wait, yes, right here. That's right. I knew I remembered seeing them. They were in, like, something small. Oh, this is a classic... Tangrim game. Your goal is to put all the pieces in the right place and facing the right way. You can rotate it with a mouse click. So, it's not letting me rotate at all. Oh, there we go. Okay, now it will. So, my guess is that Actually, that was right. Right there. So you just have to figure out, like, what... Oh, and you can move the pieces that have already been put down? That's not so much helpful unless they are in the right place. Which I doubt they are. Put it down. Like, if you back click, it rotates it. So you can't, like, put it down at all. Alright, I don't know if this is where this is supposed to go. And it kind of matches up there. Alright, let's just take everything out. Let's just start from the beginning. Because let's think about which places have to go together. I'm not very good at noticing these pictures. What if it were something like this? No, because we don't have anything that's shaped like that. It's all triangles and squares, so we know it has to fit in those triangles and squares. It all has to fit in perfectly. I mean, if we're going to go with the assumption, put this down that these were right, then those two definitely go together. And they go there. So do any of these have like another little flower thing on them? A flower petal? Because that would be what would go here. No, that doesn't really go. This has a bunch of stuff on it. Would you put that down? I mean, maybe? The big issue then is where does this piece go? Which the answer could be like right there. I think we're close. Oh no, that was right. Never mind. 
I couldn't tell if the picture was right. It didn't look right to me. Rats produce greatly contradictory results. While all the reanimated rats have supernatural physical strength, much stronger than that of regular rats, the reanimated animals suffer greatly from terrible pain and, as a result, behave extremely aggressively. Yet when I decided to halt the lives of these pathetic creatures and end their suffering, the Baron persuaded me not to do so. Instead, he told me he had a recipe for a remedy that would release the test subjects from their suffering without killing them. Well, that... That just seems like a bad idea. We got a gear! I know where that goes. Hello there. Aha! A padlock, a mouse, a glowing bulb, and a pumpkin face. Here's a pumpkin. Do we have a knife? Here's a knife. Alright, a glowing bulb, so there must be one that's out. Here's a padlock. A bottle. A spider. Oh lord. I don't... A, a bottle? I have no idea what this has done. Oh, this doesn't match up perfectly. There we go. Now it does. A duck. A duck. This is a bottle. A wrench. A fork. A spider. A duck. There is a mouse inside. Do we lure it with cheese? A hand, a bear, a rose, and an ace of diamonds. There's the rose, there's the hand. And I saw a bear. I know I did. Aha, there it is. The little teddy bear. Alright, we got a wrench. For the screws at the shipyard. Or at the ship. Not the shipyard, but... A fire extinguisher for the fire! Yay! So. This is a cyborg. Where did the cyborg come from? Oh lord. Seems like something could fit there. So we need to put something there. And then it looks like we get to play a fun game of pipes. Pickaxe must have been jammed into the crate with such force the shaft broke off. I have to figure out how to get another shaft to get the blade out. I don't think I have anything that would work as a shaft. Um. Aha, we got a pickaxe handle though. Steering wheel is missing. I don't think that the steering wheel is the only problem with flying. Unless you're already a pilot. Because like, if I had a steering wheel, I, I would not be able to fly a plane. Insisted on experimenting on the body of a dead person, but I managed to dissuade him from that madness. Still, he persuaded me to experiment on large animals and said he had a drug to relieve their suffering. I'm afraid even asking him who got the corpse of a tiger from. Indeed, I'm beginning to doubt the man is sane. So that's the tiger that we saw. Is this the steering wheel? It's a valve. Kind of looks like it could go here. So we also need something that is heart shaped. So I think we actually have to fly at some point. I guess this man must be a pilot. Oh. Oh, you need to break the stone. Now I get to search for more things. A necklace, a star, a letter, and some scissors. Hmm. A necklace, a star, your scissors, a leaf. This is like a plain steering wheel. I'm sure that's what we're going for. 
Um, what does this go to? I have no idea. Here's the leaf. Um. A letter, so we need a piece of paper I can write on it. I just need to find the piece of paper first. We also have a gem. Do we put like the gem like on this guy or on this string or no? Okay, a flight yoke, that thing. A turtle. Oh, here's a turtle. A robot. A ball? A baseball. A kettle. We're just going through all the easy things. Handcuffs. An apple. Alright, so now we just need a necklace. Do we need to pull this? No. A letter. Are you sure that this is not the parchment? It kind of seems like the parchment. A star. I don't even know what it's referring to when it says a star. Can I get a hint? Okay. That's the necklace. So I know what I need to move to the letter. What on earth do I need to move for a star? The paper is blank. This is not a paper. But it's claiming that it's over here somewhere. Okay, I don't even know what that was. I was not seeing it at all. So now we need a star. A star? What can I even move? So I need to move. I have no idea. It just says this. That's not helpful. I'm so confused. Do I need my inventory? No. I don't want to skip it for the last thing, but I can't figure out what on earth it's referring to. There's like a light right here, but it's saying like this glove compartment thing. Literally just this. This isn't a star. I don't understand. We're gonna have to skip it. I don't wanna have to do that, but... I have no idea what it was trying to have me do there. Alright, are we gonna fly this thing? Apparently so. Apparently we are. Oh god, what happened? Okay. I was wondering if it had just left without me for a second. Um, a valve would fit. I have a valve. Water. Here's a second film reel, by the way, that we just dumped a whole bunch of water on. A heart! That's for the robot back there. We need an eye key. So we've flown across a lake, but we need to go back here and give this, uh... Rotate the pipes by clicking on them to path between the heart and each crystal. You need to create, connect all the crystals to get the heart working. So there's one. There's two. There's three. There we go. Heart should be working now. That's not creepy at all. It has a letter in it. That Igor has already started carrying out experiments without my knowledge. What's 
more, he's been experimenting on human corpses. As a result, he's created a terrible, unhappy being doomed to everlasting torment. That's not good. We got dynamite. What do we need dynamite for? That's just a really strange thing to find and be like, yep, that's about right. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode of Frankenstein Master of Death here. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Pegasus, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!